All right. If you ain't been following me on social media, you know I left the great city of Atlanta, got to the airport Atlanta, had some situations, but ultimately got on the plane and we made it to Dubai. After being there nine days now, we are headed to Paris. I'm in Paris now talking to y'all about this. So they're handing out our tickets and they're taking us on Air France. And they put us in a nice place where they put the first class we ordered there, brought us some great food. Everything was good. See all them drinks? Every, even noodles, it was good. Brought us the first class. I sat down because there was some problem. I'll tell y'all about that later. But we are now settled in, and they were being real nice because they know. See, I said I'm pissed. I'm mad. And they gave us all this little stuff, you know. I ain't had no hair and whatever, but they gave us the comb, which is deaf for nothing. I started to use it to comb my. Anyway. So then we uh, we had friends, and they gave us pajamas, which I left them. We're supposed to take them with them and put them on. I actually slipped out of my clothes and was naked up under the sheets. I can't sleep with no clothes on. This lady was so nice and made the bed real nice. I laid back, and I turned on the movie. My food came in, and Marco was right beside me, and he likes to poop and pass the gas and stuff. So I raised that thing. I know they won't they won't go protect me from no farts. But anyway, it was I closed my window, and I laid down, <clears throat> and then I said, you know what? I ain't sleeping. I'm hungry, and I just it. Like my grandma said, she said it, and the breads and the butter and the jam. It was some kind of, and I dipped it, sopped it down there, and that pumpkin. It was pumpkin seed, something other, and the salad. All of that was good. I said they're doing better, and that's that was duck, and that was um. Daffy or Donald, one of them. And that, I said, you know what? This is it for me. I'm going to go duck and just eat that. I went to the bathroom. It was so nice that we had one bathroom for just us four up there in the front in this first class. Mm, so now we're in Paris. Now they came, the car picked us up. We didn't go through none of that stuff and customs. We just hand them the passport while we sat in the car and we went to eat. We ate breakfast, sat down, ate breakfast, and now we're strolling. I don't know. I can't say the name of that. I, you know, just had the Olympus. I can't talk that. Papi, 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 go for I can't do all that. Got to the hotel. I think this is a very nice hotel. Usually, I stopped in Paris one time before to take a shower on my way to Dubai, and I went to a hotel. But this hotel was just as nice, and this time I'm staying overnight. So, very nice and clean, which I'm always concerned about because I'm a clean freak. I, if I see something in the corner, I just go. I run. I can't stand it. <clears throat> so we went there, walked for a little bit. We found this place. Chat GPT told me to try, and I got another one to Donald and Daffy and them family members. I don't know who this was, but this one was better than them on the plane. I think I'm gonna go back there before I come back to America. Now this is the, this Louis Vuitton is one of their main flagship stores, and I got my little Louis on the Crocs. This store was so sickening, and the service was top tier. Look, ain't it just beautiful? Just absolute. Look at the gold horsey. Beautiful. How about that? And even the way everything look in the inside. I saw clothes I ain't seen, and none of the Louis, whether it is on Rodeo Drive, Miami, New York, ain't seen none of the stuff in there. I ain't even seen it online. Look at the little riffers. And look at the orange and the military green. Beautiful. Pearls. Oh, my God.